Now, next up, I'm only going to show you this as a alternative to styling, but you could use also Bootstrap in your React application. And I'm going to show you the two ways you could do this. You can either use the CDN. So let's search for Bootstrap. Bootstrap, there we go. And you can either include the CDN or you could install it using NPM. Uh, this is not Bootstrap for React, first of all. I'm going to show you Bootstrap just in a couple of seconds. Let's, where's the CDN? Didn't use Bootstrap in a while. I also have an entire course on this. Oh, there we go, there's the CDN. Now you can either copy this CDN link. Let's copy it. Again, just as we did with Font Awesome, go to your public folder right here, include it up here, and you should be good to go. For example, now if I would go back to my application, and let's say, let's say, let's say, I'm going to create here another card. Now let's go to card. Let's go to card. I'm going to use here instead of this card, going to pass in a class. So let's also give this card classes the prop. And I'm going to go down to the card instead of this card styling. I'm going to pass in a class name. I'm going to pass in here classes. Okay, let's go back to our app. Let's select, let's create another card. So card. And we're going to create a self-closing card. And now if I would add to this the classes property and pass in the class of card, then I should get a card. I don't have any titles, so card text some text or for example if i would create here a button you know what i already have a button let's just add to this button right here it should be it should be here let's add to this the class name of btn short for button oops i didn't save it okay so btn forgot to save my index so this is styled i don't like how this is styled so i could pass further in where's my button there's my button and btn dash danger i'm going to get a red button okay there's a little red button you could click it nothing happens because we don't have any kind of actions on it as you can see down here that this changed its style just a bit because it's now using the bootstrap type of styling now there's another way of doing this i wouldn't suggest using bootstrap in this way we're using it in a CDN and also please use your own components. So let's move on and create our own button component and style it a bit. 